What's up everyone? Welcome to the International Builder Show 2024. So we're out here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Uh, if you've never been to the Builder Show before, you 100% need to get out here. There are hundreds if not thousands of vendors here. Uh, it is an absolutely incredible show. Uh, there are everything from, or there is everything from education passes where you can learn uh, all, uh, tons of different updates on codes and all things building materials. We're here for the morning of the first day and it is going to be a crazy jam-packed three days. I plan on meeting a lot of uh, new people and interviewing a lot of new people, so I hope you guys stay tuned. It'll be a, a, an awesome time. All right, so I'm here with Michael at Powerbrush Pro and I was just walking around the International Builder Show and I saw your product and I'm like, wow, that looks that looks yeah. crazy, right? Yeah. So, automatic paintbrush. So tell us a little yeah. bit about it. Well, um, I was on the job one day and I ran out of paint with my bucket. I had to walk all the way down the roof that I was on, down ladders, down obstacles. Um, and I came up with an invention that never runs out of paint, never stops. Um, any stain, any paint, there's no limit. Easy clean, easy attachments. Um, it's one of a kind for sure. Yeah, so I've never seen anything like it before. And uh, your, your, uh, your partner, cohort, right. your partner, Jason, he was telling me that first thing, uh, let's start from the top of the brush, right? So start with the hair. He was telling me that this is kind of your own proprietary thing that you have so far. Correct. And that you'd really like to get to some of the other industry uh, leaders like Purdy. Correct. But of course, they don't give away their secrets. Mm -hmm. So you guys have gotten pretty close. This is a pretty nice, what, considered polyester. Um, it's it's a mixture between nylon and polyester, yes. Okay. So yeah, good quality brush. And then moving down, where does the paint actually come out? Uh, there's an inlet tube right through the middle. You can see the hole through the bristles. That's about a quarter of an inch um, protruded through there. Okay. Straight through. Um, you can see it as I take this off here. Just a little. Oh, okay. Little so hole. just like a sprayer head. Yep. Cool. Yep. All right. And so you just use the thumb screw, or yep, you just that's use the, the trigger. Thumb? Needle valve right here for any adjustment. You want about 10, 7 PSI coming through the sprayer at the time of, you know. So you could lay down some serious paint with this uh, thing. I mean, I painted this in about a minute. He was mobbing on his side. He's cramping up in his hand. He's constantly dipping. He's holding his bucket. I'm just chilling. Yeah, yeah. Oh, man. So, uh, Cleaning this thing. Basically, you clean it with your sprayer, right? You just start start well, cleaning out your sprayer, and then you can do that here too. Um, you can you can also use the hose spigot. You unscrew it, hook it right up to the hose spigot. We got that adapter, um, threads right on. Oh man, so, so total game changer. Yep. Okay. Um, by having it protrude through the bristles a little bit, you don't get that buildup around your brush to where it hardens. You got to use a wire yeah. brush, anything like that. By having the paint come through that inlet tube, um, it, it just cleans right out so cool yeah so and like jason told me this is your straight up launch yes sir this is the very first thing yes, that you've sir. done nobody's and... ever seen it yep okay awesome so i'm glad to be that one right <laughs> thank you I'm, Devin. I'm glad to be your first thanks Devin. um but yeah i uh i would totally be interested in some of these brushes now this one goes for how much 199 for the package deal okay um these i believe are 80 and then it goes down 10 10 dollar increments from there okay yeah for size. and so for anybody watching that doesn't paint for a living, that's that's a pretty standard price for right. when it comes to airless uh, airless accessories. Anything, yeah, you know your sprayer is going to be you know fifteen hundred to two thousand, yep. even up from there. So Correct. this is a cheap accessory, and if it can keep you running like this yep. and keep that fatigue down, and you even show it right here on the wand. Yep, yep. it's on a wand. It ratchets. You can use Graco, Titan, anything that has a airless sprayer, basically. Absolutely cool. Yeah. Um, and potentially maybe wood in the future? Yes, or? yes a little bit lighter. Um, the heaviness is for more of the balance as it's, as it's you know, oh, yeah, doing yeah. its thing. If yeah. it was light, then the brush would go like this. So we gave it a little bit of you know some weight to it, but the balance is perfect. Um, 
you know, it's pretty dialed in at this point. Sweet. And where are you guys out of? Idaho. Idaho. Boise, Idaho. Okay, cool. All right, awesome. Well, uh, pleasure to meet you, Mike. I you hope well, you guys Devin. enjoyed the video. Um, Thank I you. Will, I will link to your, you got a website? Oh, we do. And social media? Propowerbrush.com. Sweet. I will link to the uh, to the website, and uh, of course, I look forward to doing business Devin, with you. Devin, I appreciate you. Yeah. Bye.